Hello everyone, welcome back to Stalker Lost Alpha. My current mission is to find and try to release Fox. Another one of Sidorovich's unfortunate contacts. So he's this way. About 550 meters. I'm considering whether I want to explore this little uh, settlement here a little bit further to see if I can find anything else. Let's go ahead and do that before I take off. I've got a decent amount of stuff. I mean, I've got a pistol and a shotgun and a decent amount of ammo for both of them. I would really like an assault rifle with a scope, but it's probably going to be a while until I can get that. Okay, I've been down there. Oh, go away, helicopter. No one likes you. Yep, been in here. Let's see if I can fit through this window. Huh? 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 Uh, no, I'm too fat. But I can fit through this one. Yes. Let's see. I quickly ran through this place. I didn't actually search it, though. It always, or usually, pays to... Ugh. That's a grim sight. Jesus. Yet, uh, it usually pays to search around in the stalker games. Have I been down here? No, I've not. Let's see if there's anything inside of these. Ooh. Some more food. God, I've got so much food at this point. You know, what if you actually need to sleep? Because I don't see a sleep meter here. But I do have a sleeping bag. Oh, it allows you to pass time. Okay. Interesting. Could you do that in the original Stalker? I don't remember. I wonder if you're in danger if you sleep. Like, if you just sleep out in the wilds, could you be woken up by a bloodsucker or something like that? That would be a rude awakening, to say the least. It's also this here. I wonder if there's any artifacts. Honestly, I'm not entirely sure how the whole artifact hunting thing works. Because I'm used to the system where you actually take out your artifact hunting thing and you actually look at the display on it. It seems like you can't do this. I mean, I have this simple... Oh, it's an anomaly detector. It's not an artifact thing. That, that would explain it. I wonder if you can get artifact things and actually, you know, use them like an item and look at their display. Because that's what I'm used to. But maybe that wasn't present in the original Stalker? I don't know. I think I've been in here as... No, I've not been in here. Oh, God. Something on the ground. Food or vodka. What the fuck kind of a painting is that? God, the world's creepy enough. Why would somebody put that sort of a painting up? I'd put paintings of, like, clouds and birds, not creepy the ring women. Just, once again, I just love all the environmental storytelling. You just imagine people crammed into this attic, sleeping up here on these little bedrolls. Just trying to, uh, just trying to survive. You just imagine somebody was staring out this window, smoking. Pondering life. <laughs> somebody died to this thing. I 
I think this is the last building to check. Hello, my friend. Hmm, looks warm. That's beautiful. I'll leave you alone. I wonder if they added new musical tracks in Lost Alpha. Yeah, I think I checked this building, didn't I? Check it very quickly. Never hurts to have more food and stuff. Oh, batteries are running low. I'm okay with using them pretty much all of the time. They're fairly cheap now, and they're going to become even cheaper once I actually have a decent amount of money. It's a little shed. There's nothing in here. Oh, no, I didn't go in here. Ah, if only this car was up and running. I'd love to drive it. I think the minimum price for a car is like 150,000 monies. So, given that at the moment I have 2,000, uh, it's probably going to be a little bit until I can afford it. Can't pick it up. Wait a minute. Wasn't there one more thing this way? This pa yeah, this place I definitely went into. I remember going up there. And I remember you playing the harmonica. Oh, apparently you're a multi-instrumentalist. Nice. Okay, that I believe is the last building. Yeah, that is. Alright, let's head off to our destination. Wait a minute. Boxes. Yay, bread. Who would put... Who would put bread in a box? I mean, like, and nail it shut. It's not like it just had a latch. You can't even open it. You have to destroy it to get into it. It's like someone put... partially cut bread inside of a box and then, like, nailed it shut? What the hell? Weirdos. There's a lot of places I could visit on the way as well. I mean, there's whatever this is. Right here. And what is this? To Darkscape. What the fuck is Darkscape? Is that... This? To Dark Valley. Is that new? I'm pretty sure that's new. That doesn't sound familiar. To Rostock Factory. It also sounds entirely terrifying, and I'm guessing I probably don't want to go there. Until I have decent equipment. I don't know. Let's just go to the destination. What the hell is that? Oh, dog. I'm just gonna keep going. I think if the dogs are not together in a pack, and or you're not near them, they often don't attack. So, I'll just avoid until something else becomes necessary. Yeah, I think that's just a stalker. They're not showing up as red, so... They're neutral to nice to me. <laughs> Looks like he's going for a jog. Oh yeah, that's the bandit place I attacked. Yes, yeah, so that's what that is. Alright, let's just continue on. I remember this place quite a bit. This broken bridge here. That you can go under or around. I think there's some bandits that are kind of occupying it. I don't remember whether they're whether they're hostile or if they tr like try to get a payment from you or something. Laser beam. What is that? Like paper? Ooh, can I ride this? Let's go. To victory on my steed of trailery. Do 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 do. Oh, and it's screwed. I give up. Yeah, this looks like it's been changed a bit. I don't remember this huge structure here. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. They're showing up as red. Wait, but if they're red, why haven't they attacked me yet? Military. 
Military. Uh, yep. Pretty sure military hates me. There's somewhere near my faction standing. Wait a minute. No, it says military minus 100 neutral. Okay, so why are they showing up as red? Let's see if they shoot me in the face. Uh, no need to fight here. Stay calm and try to talk with them. Okay, I can do that. And while talking to them, I'm going to throw a bolt to their face. It seems they won't let you pass. Try to find another way, or if you're really crazy, put them on ice. Do I have radiation poisoning? No, I don't. Okay. <sighs> right, so they won't even let me pass. They don't even want payment. They just don't want to let me pass. So, let's find another way, shall we? Let's go up and around. Check out what's in this building first, though. Can barely even see this on the map. I don't know what that says, but it probably doesn't say something good. And I think what sends an even stronger message than this Russian warning is this. Something was either coming from here or into here through this pipe. Going over there. Wait a minute. If that's what I think it is, I'm pretty sure that area was filled with electricity electricity anomalies before. I don't know if it still is. Check this building out, though. See if there's anything inside of it. Okay, maybe I can't even go into it. Ooh. I believe these have goodies. Well, sometimes. Hmm. Hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. I think that's like a military med kit. I love it when you find secrets. It's so satisfying. Bandages, bandages. Sweet, what did I get? Oh, it's a scientific first aid kit. It's worth quite a bit more. Yep. Um, oh yeah, so it doesn't just heal wounds. Um, but it also eliminates radiation. Mm-hmm. Alright, sweet. I've got six medkits now. And eight bandages. That is awesome. So it doesn't look like you can go inside of the building, but uh, maybe I can get on the roof. I might break my legs doing this. Nope. Okay. <laughs> I love that running animation with a knife when you're sprinting. <laughs> I'm pretty sure people don't normally put their hands that high up in their face when they're running. Looks goofy. Yeah, there's no way inside. Wait, how do I get out? Oh, there we go. <laughs> that works. Finding goodies. Alright, how do I get up there? Can I go up there? Yeah, I can just go up here. Ooh, I wonder if they're actually up here. I don't think they're up here. I think they're just down below. Yeah, it's a watchtower, but there's nobody in it. I can probably just walk. Yeah, I can walk. I, maybe I shouldn't sprint. They might hear me up here. But I should be fine walking. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shit. That's a sniper. Oh, 
Okay. I'm gonna want to give him a very wide berth. I wonder if he would shoot me if he saw me on the other side, or only if he sees me, like, moving through here. Hmm. Well, what the hell is that? What was that? There's somebody in the tree? Is it a bird with a sniper? Oh. Seems to be some sort of a bug. Like, you look the opposite way, it still shows up. Huh. Alright, let's turn off my light. Makes me a little bit easier to see. love the environmental detail that's in this. It's beautiful. Just look at this scene. Here. Let me turn that off and let me turn that off. Look at that. Is that not beautiful? Anything on the map? I could follow the tracks back, I suppose. Oh, you know, I think there's a train back there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a train on the map. Let's go follow the tracks. I hear something rumbling. Notice something really cool. You actually trigger the sound of like. You actually trigger the sound of the chain link fence by running into it. Really cool. Oh shit, radiation. Hmm. Is it blocked off, or can I hop it? Maybe more to the point, do I want to hop it? I'm not quite sure how to tell whether I'm actually getting radiation po- Oh, yeah, I'm getting radi radiation poisoning. Okay. Um. I do want to know if I can hop it, though, so let's just test it real quick. Oh, you can. Okay, okay. okay g give me back, please. Okay. And let's get a little tipsy. There we go. <laughs> oh yes, I tried to do this before. Monster cam. Turn off the UI. Get real low. You know, it's like the uh, monster cam when you're going through the bushes. You know, you're stalking someone like... down there. <laughs> Not that I can see it very well. Holy shit. Check out this little settlement. It looks like it's the only one here before I hit this uh, destination. Dear God. Dear God. Oh my God. He won't even walk straight. Uh, uh, okay. Here we go. Oh, wait a minute. I actually can't walk down this. It's like some invisible wall. Strange. Could be a bloodsucker lair. It could be. They might hide in a place like this. It's rather dark. Oh, I see some fleshes. Alright. Let's be very careful. Does look like there's a fire in there, though. Maybe there's actually someone inside of it. Let's take a peek in the windows. Hmm. 
Oh, what the fuck is that? What in the fuck is that? And who is messaging? Uh, don't look at me. Who's messaging me? If somebody is planning to move to garbage, do it warily. There's some kind of turmoil between locals again. Okay. Uh, what the fuck is that? I... Shit. Uh, do I want to kill it? I mean, I do. Can I? Um... Okay, uh, what kind of shots do I have for this thing again? Do I have all three? No, I'm out of slugs. Right, what does that one do? It's... Oh, it's accurate, right. And it's armor-piercing. Well, I definitely don't need armor-piercing, but accurate wouldn't be a bad thing. Alright, let's try him. Uh, I think I'm gonna try to snipe him from here, but first, let's take a look around and see if there's any more. It seems like that's the only one. Okay. That did not kill it, but it lost a lot of blood, so I definitely hit it. Okay, it's not even moving. How many fucking shots does that thing take? Also, why is it not coming towards me? This kind of feels cheap. It should be trying to attack me. Is this thing invincible? Okay, wow. I'm glad it didn't try to attack me because given how many shots that took, it probably would have killed me. Depending on its type of attack. And how fast it is. Alright. Nice and easy. There might be more. Clear all the rooms. Check upstairs. Okay, it's clear. What in the hell are you? Do you have a name? Carlick's ear. Carlick. Does that mean it's from a Carlick, or is that a specific person's name? Mutant part of unknown properties. There are rumors it left to dry up and then grounded into a. Wait. Oh, there are rumors if left to dry up and then grounded into a fine powder can be used to treat baldness. <laughs> <laughs> However, most of the times this uh, that story is only heard very late at night around those campfires with a lot of scattered empty vodka bottles left laying nearby. You don't say. Well, it's apparently worth 2000 so that is an expensive monster part. Things are fucking terrifying. I mean, are they like mutated children or what? Because they're very small, but they have like the head and chest of an adult almost. Ugh. Okay, any boxes upstairs? No, looks like that's it. If I can hit the fence, I probably won't break my legs. Well, I didn't break my legs anyway. Ooh, is this the other end of that tunnel? Yeah, I think that's the other end of that tunnel. The one that at least used to have the electricity. Oh, they're actually going inside the building. I heard like a breathing noise. 
It's down this well. That might just be the noise of a flesh. I don't know. Alright, I don't see anything down there, and I don't really want to get myself trapped in there, because I probably won't be able to get out. No, don't attack me. I don't want to have to kill you. They only chase you for a bit. They're kind of... They're easily scared, although they do seem to attack you when they're in packs, such as this. <sighs> Didn't want to have to do that. Yeah, they're defending their territory, I guess, is their, their pad, their place. Let's take a look at this tunnel. Just make sure they're not chasing me. Hmm. Could be artifacts in there, perhaps? It's a little bit hard to tell. I think I need an artifact container. Let's not bother with that yet. Or not artifact container, but artifact uh, searching device of some sort. I'm assuming those exist, right? Oh, come on. Stop attacking me. I think I just killed the entire family. I feel bad. I'm actually low on ammo. Let me stick some more up there. It's not much, though. Alright, once again. Let's check the windows. You know what the worst thing is? When you find a building that has a basement. Oh god, basements. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. This place has a basement. No, no, no. Oh, shit. <sighs> okay, upstairs first. Basement later. Oh, what was that? Huh. Torsts the lights. Which reminds me, I should... Yeah, I actually need to eat. What should I go with? What should I have for today? Some canned corn? That's a big description for that canned corn. I like that. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's beer. Let's go with, uh, Torst's Delight. Actually, let's go with whatever's heaviest. Um, everything except bread is pretty heavy. So, let's go with Torst's Delight. I actually should store some of my stuff. I'm not sure where to store it. But I should store it somewhere, because I don't need, like, ten cans of food on me. Okay. <sighs> Downstairs. Okay, it doesn't look bad. In fact, I don't even think there's anything down there. No, mm, just some discarded furniture. Okay, I believe there's one more building. I wonder if there's any way to get up there. I don't suppose these are steps I can use? Anything up there? I don't see anything. Nah, I don't think there's anything up there. Just a barn.
Oh. Energy drink. Okay, looks like that's it for this little place, yeah. I love taking detours. You know, you think you're going to go to a quest objective and then you see an interesting building and you end up spending, like, all of your time there? It's awesome. Honestly, I think doing the... the missions in this game are kind of a minor part of actually playing it. Most of the fun is just in exploring. Yeah. Cars and any sort of a vehicle that's just kind of uh, old. They're usually full of radiation. In fact, I've got a little bit of poisoning. Got too close. And I imagine it's probably infecting all of this water. Which is not a good thing. So that sniper asshole doesn't shoot me. He's not even looking in my direction. What was that noise? Ah, forget it. Let's get this done. Okay, we're negotiating for a hostage rescue, so I suppose I should put away my weapon. We must parlay! Who dare approach this area without invitation? You better come and have a chat. I would love to. Can we have some tea too? Tea and crumpets. All right, so who do I talk to? The uh, suspicious man in the black robe thing? Looks like he's in a cult or the other suspicious man in a black robe thing? No, seriously, who the hell is the leader? You? 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 Who? You? No. You. Can you tell me why... Can you tell me why you holding Fost Fox hostage? Why the hell should you care? Got anything to say about it? Yeah, I want to cut a deal. <laughs> wow, he doesn't have a high opinion of... Uh, of uh, Sidorovich. So the bigoted fat idiot wants a deal. Okay. They want the flash drive he has about that. I'll try to ask him in nicer terms. Okay. So, do I have to head back now? Oh my god. I'm the errand boy. I have to go back and forth. Whoa. Message from him. I needed you to kill those zombies in the tunnel. Marked one. They cause problems for my trade network. Okay. That'll give me an interesting task on my way back. I guess I'm going back through the tunnels. Yay. Alright. Is someone babbling like demonic chants? What in the hell is wrong with you? I'm out of here. Well, I guess on my way back, I'll follow up on whatever the hell I heard over here. I don't see anything. getting close to nighttime. I'd prefer not to be out at night, although it might be incredibly atmospheric. Oh. 
Okay. Here we go. This is where the zombies are, right? Yeah. Alright. What's, what am I getting hit by? Is that radiation or is that psi? And I wonder if that door opens. Whoa. What was that? Is that radiation? I'm not poisoned. Oh, it does open. Shit. What's, <laughs> what's in here? Oh, God. Close that behind me. Jesus. This game is just like throwing food into my inventory. It's uh, definitely quite a bit different from Misery in that respect. In Misery, I had to pay like 50% of your money, hell, more than that in the early game, just to keep yourself alive with food. I guess I'm going down. Oh! What <gasps> the hell, man? Don't you know how to use a ladder, you fucking idiot? Oh god, how deep does this go? bunch of bodies. Looks like they were defending some sort of a barricade. This is a long hallway. I don't like long hallways. What the fuck happened here? Whoa! Those are zombies! Okay. Thank god they're slow. And that one's kind of invisible. Oh shit. Okay, that one's going a bit faster. Um Uh wait, wait, wait. Uh shit. Can I can I not go back? What? Fuck. 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 Okay, they seem to be dumb, though. I don't have any more ammo for that. The shotgun, right? No, I don't. Get me the fuck over the fucking thing! Okay. Thank God. Jesus. I'm assuming you need to shoot them in the head. Because zombies. Or maybe they just never... Do they just never die? It says kill the zombies. Any further information? It just says take out the zombies. None of them have died yet, have they? Okay. Yeah, they're just waking up again. My god, their pathfinding is terrible. Maybe I should see what's behind them.
if I can manage to get behind them. Okay, there we go. Uh, yeah, I don't know how to kill them. Oh, great, there's more. Okay, you seem to have died. Okay, now you've died. Okay, so maybe just keep shooting them? Or maybe shoot them when they're on the ground. I don't know. Oh my god, I'm out of ammo. Fuck. I don't have any more, do I? Oh, I do have... this. Okay. What the hell's behind this? This place is strangely well lit. I might have to... Holy fuck, this place is huge! My god, okay, I think I'm gonna have to come back here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to come back here with more ammo. I'm gonna see if I can take the rest of these zombies out here. With my extremely limited ammo. Wait, where'd the rest of my ammo go? Get back up there. Okay, there we go. Yeah, they just took a lot of shots. There's a rumor that at the army warehouse, one supplier set up shop in a small basement. He doesn't sell much. Okay. Okay. I think I killed them for real. And I've got three shots left. Yeah, three shots of this, and three shots of the other kind of ammo. Little bit low. I am not going to go exploring any deeper without more supplies. No way. I wonder if my health restores on its own just over time if you're, you know, like, well-fed and well-hydrated. Looks like it does. Yeah, it's going up very slowly. There you go, that's how you use a ladder. It's an amazing concept, isn't it? This way. Of course, and now I have no ammo to take them out. Shit. Well, I got one, and the other one seems to have died due to walking into something it shouldn't have. Maybe I can kill the rest the same way. Or I could knife them to death, I suppose. Oh, they're falling down to take a nap. It's cute. I could try knifing them. That seems like a particularly bad idea, though. Surprise! It was a terrible idea. And now I can hear it eating my guts. Ew. Let's try that again, but this time let's just run past them. I think this is a safe way. Now where? Oh, this way. That is an acid pit. Ooh, okay. The range of that acid pit is even higher than I thought. Okay. 
Alright, I need to come back there with a lot more supplies. And it is getting dark. So I think I might want to sleep after I get back. Oh shit. Oh, don't go into the water. Ah, it's not too bad. Well, I mean, it's bad enough that I'm losing health. I wonder if the radiation goes away on its own. I guess we'll find out. Right, so let's get the details from Zadorovich, and then let's buy some batteries and definitely some ammo. And then let's go to sleep so that it's daytime. Sprint anymore, I don't have enough stamina. Whoa. Calm down, you're fine there, buddy. What have you got in there? Alright, they say you have a flash drive with that. Ha <laughs> ha, should have known. Okay. So what kind of information do they want from you, huh? about the hidden underground labs and experiments. Maybe that's where I just was, actually. It... I mean, there might have been a lab down there, I don't know. Hmm. The traders think it has something related to their condition. Hmm. There's an unspoken, un unspoken rule around here to keep the whole secret labs thing minimal. Okay. Unless it can help us head further north past the Brain Scorcher. I love that name. Okay. Take the info back to our lovely friends and get Fox out of here. Or out of there, rather. Okay. I will tell them that. If you want Fox back in pieces, that is. <laughs> yeah, I'll sweeten his words a little bit. By the way, do you have a job for me? Find a flesh's eye. Uh, I can do that no problem. In fact, I already have one. I'm up for it. I'm here for the job. And I'm done. <laughs> a little bit of money, some water, bandages, medkit. Okay. You have another job? No. Alright, time to sell crap. And buy some stuff. So let's sell this ear. It's worth 2,000. Hopefully I don't need that for a quest or something. How much is this food worth? Significant amount. And you know, I don't need this much food. Like, I don't need anywhere near this much food. In fact, let's just sell everything... Ooh, peanut snack. That sounds delicious. But let's just go ahead and sell... Ah, should I sell it? It's not worth that much, I guess. I'm probably going to end up hoarding it, but... Uh, I guess I'll keep it for now. Yeah, I guess I'll keep everything for now. Aside from the ear. Alright, I've got almost 5,000. Let's buy some batteries. Let's get three of those. You really don't want to be running out. Can I afford a new weapon? AK. Almost 7,000. Well, there's no point in buying a weapon if you can't get ammo for it. Because it is 100% useless. So I guess I'll just buy ammo for my current weapons. Yeah, I can't really afford anything that I don't already have. Alright, how much do shotgun rounds cost? About a hundred for some of those. Alright, that's no problem. Let's get 30 shots of that. And let's get some slugs. Yeah, and then let's buy some... Let's see, he didn't have ammo for the Viper before. Let's see if he has it now. It's 919. That's 918. No, he still doesn't. He only has pistol ammo. 
Okay, so that's not armor piercing. And this is armor piercing. I don't think I need armor piercing rounds. They're probably more expensive, I'm guessing. Yeah, it looks like they're slightly more expensive. Let's just buy all of those pistol rounds. You know, it wouldn't hurt to have some of these until I get a better weapon, just in case I go up against any people that want to kill me. Alright, it's pretty good. What about armor? Hmm, I can actually afford a leather jacket, but I think I already have one. Yeah, I already have one. There's no point. A merc suit would be wonderful, but that costs a hell of a lot. Alright, I think I'm good. Yeah, I think I'm good to go. Let's go ahead and put my ammo in there. Good hunting, stalker. Do I want to sleep or do I want the atmosphere? You know what? I haven't actually really been outside when it's nighttime, so... What the hell? Also, my ammo, uh, my armor is slightly hurt. Now it only protects me 10% instead of... Or 9% instead of 10%. I wonder if there's a way to fix it. Or if I just have to buy new armor. I might just have to buy new armor, I don't know. Alright, let's conquer those tunnels. My battery's about to run out. I wonder if you go out at nighttime if if that causes certain things to pop up that didn't exist before. Like maybe bloodsuckers come out at night or something. I'm going to take an energy drink to increase my stamina. Um. Oh yeah, that worked. Alright, here we go. Kind of like a zigzag pattern. That should do it, I think. Can't actually see his head. Oh, there we go. Whoa, where did you go? Into the ceiling, apparently. Okay, any more? Ah, yes, one more. Ooh, this is a stash. Oh, pff, and it's got nothing in it. Wonderful. There we go. Alright, so that's all I had to do. But I do want to see what's down here.
Let's try not to break my legs this time. Oh. Of. Oh, all right. Here we go. Let's go room by room. Surprised there's no one actually here. I mean, it's got light, so it's apparently got power. It's got plenty of places to sleep. Seems well protected. I mean, all you have to do is clear out the zombies. Ooh. Definitely a military place. Can I mess with this? No. Nope. Looks like a fuse box. Is that eerie or what? Crickets. Strange. Hmm, is this a big circle? Some ammo. Oh, a ton of ammo for my pistol. Whoa, what was that? Oh, <laughs> it's just the stuff disappearing. Okay. I guess I'll put it all up there. Well, let's take away some and replace it with a shotgun. There we go. What are those blips? What does that mean? Does that mean contacts present? Because it looks like the number in the bottom left of my map in the top left corner. One, two. Three. Hmm. Oh, I'm directly underneath the thing. I wonder if that actually leads up to them. Better turn off my light. No, we're not high enough yet to get out. Yeah, it looks like we might actually be about to leave and hit the surface. Ah, it's locked. 
All right, let's see what the other way, where the other way goes. That's where I came from, so yeah, I have not explored these places. Let's go ahead and replace my light. Uh, my battery. Oh, that's an army first aid kit. So how's that better than a normal first aid kit? Just more health? I guess it probably just restores more health. What was that? Oh, I think that's anti-radiation. Yeah. Anti-radiation drugs. Ew, there's fucking blood in the toilets. Uh, there's blood on top of the toilet uh, reservoir, or whatever you call that thing. That's disgusting. Whoa, autosave. Does that mean something big's about to happen? Hmm, this way goes up too. Wait, is this? Oh, it's back here! I never saw this door. That's where I met the people before I went on that uh, bandit little bandit raid thing. Neat. Okay. Those tools. No, those aren't tools. I, I'm still in the uh, misery mindset of like, I need to find tools so I can upgrade my weapons, but you can't actually upgrade your weapons, can you? At least, I don't think you could. For all I know, they've added that ability, but yeah. Okay. Well, let's venture forth and go on over. It's unlike running through the uh, horrible, terrifying wilderness at night. Want to go this way. Look at that sky. Fucking hell, it's dark. Ow. It's at nighttime when your imagination can really go wild with all the noises you hear. <laughs> 